Hello boys and girls, it's Mr. Giomini. Gonna do a problem here that we have not really seen yet. We talked about it a little bit in class today, but it's definitely something that maybe gives a little problems. So we have a new equation here. We have 5a equals 4m over 9 minus m over 3 plus 1 half. Now, what we want to do is obviously solve this equation for m, evaluate for m. But to do that, we have to mess with all these fractions and this could be kind of tedious because you know I'm gonna have to add a half or subtract a half from both sides so the best thing to do with this is look at your denominators 18 9 3 and 2 and find their least common multiple now in this case it's it's not bad least common multiple of 18 9 3 and 2 is 18 so what happens here is you're actually going to multiply each fraction by 18, and I'm just going to put 18 over 1. So really, this problem becomes 18 over 1 times 5 eighteenths, which is equal to m over 4, or m 4m over 9 times 18 over 1 minus... 18 over 1 minus m over 3 plus 18 over 1 times 1 half. And then doing this, I'm actually going to make this problem a lot easier for me to solve. These 18s cancel out, so I'm left with really is here is 5 is equal to. Now, common factor here is 9. That leaves it as a 2, so I have 2 times 4m. That gives me 8m minus okay common multiple common factor here is 3 3 goes in 18 6 times so I have 6m plus common factor here is 2 this leaves me with a 9 9 times 1 is 9 now it makes it a little bit easier for me to solve first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to combine like terms I have 8m's taking away 6m's so I'll rewrite this now I have 5 equals 2m plus 9. Okay, I want to get rid of this 9. To get rid of it, I need to do the opposite. So I'll subtract 9 from both sides. That cancels this out. Subtract 9 from this side. I'm left with 4, or a negative 4, is equal to 2m. I don't want to know what 2m is equal to. I want to know what 1m is equal to. So I'm going to divide both sides by 2, because that's the opposite of multiplication is division. To get rid of that 2, I need to do the opposite. So I divide this side by 2. I am left with m is equal to, well, that becomes negative 4 divided by 2. That gives me negative 2. Now, if I substitute that back in, I'm going to substitute back into here. So I have plug in a negative 2 here, plug in a negative 2 here. 8 times negative 2 is negative 16 minus 6 times negative 2 is negative 12 plus 9. So it's negative 16. This becomes plus 12. See, negative 16 plus 12 is negative 4. Negative 4 plus 9 gives me 5. 5 equals 5. That is a check. Hope this helps you out for tonight's homework. Take care.